Hi there, Ryan. How you doing? Hey, uh, I uh, opt to uh, solve this problem for you using a video and some graphic because I can actually sketch something on the uh, whiteboard um, other than just writing the solution for you so you understand it better. Okay? So a new problem, you got a building that's actually a, a person that's standing on top of the building here and uh, he's 30 feet above, uh, sorry, 30 meter on top of the building from the ground up. And um, he's looking at two boats with an angle of depression. So he's looking at this, say this is the first boat he's looking at. So boat one is here. Okay. And the angle of depression is actually this angle here. I'm going to draw a dashed line. Something like that. All right. So this angle here is looking at first angle of depression. One boat is at 10 degree angle of depression. Then there's another boat here. Okay. And that is looking at at angle of depression of 18 degrees. So this angle here, depression angle is 18 degrees for this boat here. So we'll call this boat one, and this is boat two. And I would like to call that point A, B, and C here at the building. I want to join this segment, ABC. And the question is, uh, he wants the distance between the two boats. So he wants that distance between this point and that point. And that distance is, we call this AB segment. That's what he wants. So I'll put a question mark. That's what we need to find. And uh, this will be a BC segment right here. And where the person is standing, I'll actually call it the origin. I'll call it O. Okay. So as you can see, that this 10 degree angle and this alpha are the same angles because that is called alternating angles, because this is a, a horizontal line, this is a horizontal line, and that's an inclined line between the two horizontal lines. So this alpha is actually, for this is, this alpha is 10 degrees. Okay. And this uh, angle here, I'm going to call it uh, sorry. I'm going to call this angle here beta and this angle beta is also this angle here and uh, so it's also not the alternate the um, alternating angle and this angle is 18 degrees you know the height of the building now you need that distance a b okay so uh, from this whole uh, triangle here i am going to draw it in different color so you can see it triangle a o c okay And we have another triangle. I'm going to draw it in magenta. 
just to be more clear, you have angle B O C right here. So what's striking about these two angles is that they both have a common elevation height, which is elevation OC, okay? So uh, just using simple trigonometry, if we take tangent of angle alpha, I'm gonna go back to black, tangent of 10 degrees, which is alpha, equal to opposite, which is the height of the building, and we know it's 30 meters. Okay, so 30 meter divided by the adjacent. Well, the adjacent is segment AB plus segment BC. Okay, so I call it segment AB plus segment BC. So solving for segment AB plus segment BC, AB plus BC is equal to, if we rearrange this, we get 30 meter over tangent 10, tangent 10 degrees. So go to our calculator and we find 30 over tangent 10, 170.13, I'm gonna call it 170.1 feet. Just stay with one, so I'm gonna call it 170. Point one meters, sorry, not feet, meter. We're working with metric, okay? So 170.1 meter. Also, I know I can find segment BC with the same way because tangent beta is equal to the elevation, which is 30 meter, the opposite, divided by segment BC between this point and this point. So, so segment BC is equal to 30 meter divided by tangent 18 degrees. And if I do this calculation, I find that it's 92.3 feet. No, sorry, again, 92.3 meter, not feet. We're used to the uh, English system, so that's why we're kind of, but we're working with metric here, okay? So what is the difference between the two bolts? In, in, so we want this distance here, okay? Well, it's AB, right? So how do we find AB? Well, we know that AB plus BC equal to AC. Hmm? Therefore, AB equal to segment AC minus segment BC. And what's segment AC? Segment AC is nothing but AB plus BC. So that's all, that whole thing is segment AC. So that comes to 170.1 meters minus segment BC, which is 92.3 meters. And that equals to 
170.1 minus 92.3. I got 77.8 meters is the difference. Or sorry, is the distance between the two boats A and B. Thank you. Uh, if you like what you see, you could uh, contact me for any other problems on uh, the Wise Ant platform and uh, set up a lesson. Take care. Bye.